my life on the X list. Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's me, the Diva X, and it is July 22nd, 2010, and I am running hella late. I took a little nappy nap before I was supposed to get ready, um, just because I woke up really, well, not early, well, the thing is, I haven't been sleeping because it's been kind of like, um, I've had a lot on my mind, and, um, so I've been, like, laying in bed, like, restlessly thinking about stuff that I really should just not be thinking about, but I can't put it out of my mind. So, yeah, I'm thinking about buying some NyQuil or something, because I am just not sleeping that well. Well, I'm not, I'm, well, when I, once I sleep, I sleep well. It's just the getting to sleep part is the issue. Um, but today I woke up rather early for considering the amount of the time I went to sleep. And so I'm just kind of like, ugh. So then I took a nap today, um, because I needed to, and... Uh, overslept, of course. I woke up an hour later than I was supposed to, so... And then even then, when I woke up, I was just like, 15 more minutes. So, um, you know, it's just one of those days, I guess. Um, but not... You know, it's cooled down in Fresno here. It's, you know, still up there, but it's not as hot as it was. I mean, during the daytime, it's still 100 and whatever, but, uh... It's supposed to be cooling down, so that doesn't help either, and... Yeah... Um, la, 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 what am I talking about? Let's talk about, okay, so <laughs> lately I've been completely obsessed and, uh, I love CSI Miami. Like, I never, I'm not, I used to, like, when I was at, living with, at home with my parents, I used to love watching, um, like, you know, um, NYPD Blue or whatever, and I, you know, once I got my own place, I really stopped really watching television and getting into television as much, only because, um, I just did, and I actually, I mean, I wouldn't say I stopped watching television, I just started watching television on my terms, which is DVR, like, I would DVR stuff that I wanted to watch rather than sitting there watching, um, a block of television, of, you know, every night or whatever it was, um, and now I really don't have the time to do that either, so thank God to DVR. But DV, uh, but CSI Miami is is a really great show. I know I sound like a dork, but I love their all their little technology and stuff. But that's just me. You guys knew that already. If you guys been watching my videos before, you guys know that I love technology and things about it and so on and so forth. So, speaking of technology, it is July twenty second already, and I haven't heard anything about pre ordering my white or even ordering my white iPhone. So I'm a little concerned. Um, I don't really want a black one. I mean, I will hold on to my G, 3GS or whatever until, um, or if they're not going to make it, then I guess I'll just wait until they figure out what the hell. Um, I really, really wanted it, but I don't want a black phone. Like, I'm, I know it's a cool phone, and, but I just, I, I'm, I feel that strongly about it that I wouldn't even buy it. I mean, I still have my flip cam for the HD video, so I mean... No, you know, I'm not losing, I'm not missing out there. So I think I'm just gonna, I, at this point, I'm still waiting. I think my eyelash, um, is poking my eye. Because <laughs> every time I blink, I feel like I'm like, there's something in my eye, but th I just checked before I started doing this video, and there's nothing in my eye. So I, you know, I don't know what the hell, and it's like, it goes with my blink, so I know that it's with, it's like attached to, like, whatever, my eyelid. So, um, if you see me, like, get crazy in a minute <laughs> with my eyeball, um, you know why. And also, of course, uh, Dance Your Ass Off. Love that show. Um, I'm glad it's whittling down. I'm glad, you know, the people that are gonna, you know, are here to stay, are here to stay, and, uh, I can't wait to see what happens. Um, can't wait for you to see what happens, too. It's great. Um, what else? Kathy Griffin. Um, and there's another show, Big Brother 12. Love Big Brother. I, I know I did a whole blog series last year about it. Or not series, but, you know, I talked about it a lot. Big Brother 12 is so ridiculous. Like, okay, here's the first thing. Okay, Brendan, obviously hot. Love him. Hayden, hot, too. I mean, you know, Brendan's my first choice. Or Brendan, sorry. Brendan's my first choice. Um, I, I like Rachel, but I think for being in the house only... 15, 14, whatever days. Uh, hello, girl. I mean, I know she's a dancer or whatever. Well, I don't know which. Well, I, she's apparently really smart, but then she has, like, these new titties that, you know, like, kind of compensate or kind of take away from her smartness or lead people to believe that she's not as smart. Or, you know, that's that's what the girl, the other girls um, are, like, basing her on. And I think it's just, like, you know, that's that's tacky all on its own. And Brittany and Monet, bleh. 
Britney looks like fucking Christina Aguilera when Christina Aguilera first came out. It's so crazy. Like, if she just wore black eyeliner like Christina Aguilera did, um, or does, um, I think she would look like Christina Aguilera. It's so crazy. Monet, uh, who cares? Get her off. Um, but back to Brendan. <laughs> Who decided to let him, or who decided to tell him to let Rachel cut his hair? His hair is so fucked up. It's not even funny. He's cute. I, I mean, I don't really care if he, I don't, I don't, I don't want to, when, for those competitions, I don't really care who wins. I like at the end of the game, whoever played the game deserves to win. I don't really care. I'm not going to say I hope this person wins because, um, you know, I haven't really seen their gameplay yet. The only person I saw that was playing, that, well, Brady and Monet, man, they're playing the game, but they're playing it in like, I'm the bitch type of way. And it's like, you know, who cares about you guys? Get off the show. Uh, I don't think they'll make, I don't think they'll make it far. That's just me. But Big Brother 12, amazing. Love it. Um, Enzo, he just annoys me. I think he's a competitive player, and I really do like his game, but he just annoys me. He annoys me. He's like, meow, meow, what the fuck? Like, dude, get over it. Get over yourself. Oh, God, I'm just talking up a storm. Drag you started. Okay, drag you. Okay, I was expecting something else. To me, drag you is a little too emotional. Um, it, it, gets, it gets too... It's too hard, like... It's too, uh... I don't know. I just, I, it's like watching Oprah, <laughs> like, you know, like, or, or, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's very, this one got emotional, like, the first one, like, I don't know, I thought it was gonna be more, f I mean, it's exciting, and it's fun to watch, and it's cute, but I just wasn't impressed, like, I mean, I'll continue to watch, and it's on my DVR, don't get me wrong, but it's just, like, it just wasn't what I was anticipating it being. But, you know, hey, that's just my standards. I, you know, whatever. I'm glad the drag and uh, everything about drag is becoming more popular into the forefront and more accepted um, with this type of show. And I think that um, it's cool, you know. Um, but I, I just, I don't know. It's, it's, it's just, there's a conflict there between the, the type of show it is and then the, the, the fun and excitement that usually that would go into it. I don't know. I think it's just too it's too extremes, um, especially particularly this first episode. Maybe it changes it up in the next episodes because you can only go, you know, up from here. I right? I feel so. We'll see what happens. And um, I've just been yapping about TV. I watch too much TV. It's all DVR, so you know it's all condensed. Like I watch it all at once. Um, so it's good. <laughs> it's better than watching like all TV all day long at you know whatever. So, eh, I don't have a problem with it. It's 10.55, I'm running late, I'm glad I talked through so I don't have to cut and edit and stuff like that, so I'm just going to stop now and post. Um, also, I have, a lot of people have been sending messages saying I should start a new channel and just put my blogs on there, so I'm really considering that, but then people would have to follow me, and I don't really know that it's all, like, necessary, because, um, I guess there's a lot of people that are, like, really coming down on, like, the, 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 the um claims and stuff and actually um my they still keep offering me a partnership thing and i just haven't accepted it because i know that there's stuff on my channel that isn't mine that isn't uh stuff that i've created solely um for as music intros you know clips and stuff like that so i don't want to even try because i know they would reject me but they said if i but if i start a new channel then that might work out better and just keep it completely, you know, just develop my own stuff and, and work that way. So I don't know. I'm really considering it. It's not going to be something that's gonna, I'm going to jump into because all my stuff is on this channel and um, I don't know that I really want to um, fuck it up, literally. So if you, I don't know, we'll see what happens, but for now, everything's going to stay the same, but it's just something I do have in my, on my brain um, because it's been put there. Um, but yeah, I'm out and thank you for watching. I just, yeah, okay, bye. Thank <laughs> you.